Hey guys and welcome to this video. Today I want to show you the text reveal effect which is often used in vlogs and music videos. So first of all you need a clip on which you want to apply this effect. So I choose this clip. In your clip it's really important that you got a moving person or moving object that reveals your text. So in my case that's this person. So I cut out my clip and then I go to effects, I go to titles and I drag and drop a text plus node into the timeline. In the inspector you can now change the text, the font, the color and the size. Alright, my text is set up and now we just need to copy and paste this clip by pressing Alt and the left mouse button at the same time. Then go with this clip selected into the fusion page, drag and drop a polygon mask into the node field and connect the polygon mask. Now hit the invert box. And now try to mask out the side of your person where the text should appear. So in my case that's the left side. So I go to the last frame where you see nothing but our person. So that should be this frame. Then I create a keyframe and I create a mask left of my person. Now I go one frame to the right and I start with masking out the left part of my person. To create new masking dots you can just simply left click on this masking line. And then try to mask out one side of your moving object or person. Now again go one frame to the right and adjust the mask so that the left part of your person is masked out. And of course if you want to zoom in or zoom out you just need to press Ctrl on your keyboard and scroll with your mouse. Now try to continue with masking for all frames of your clip. Alright, now I'm done with masking and at your last frame you just can increase the size of your mask so that everything is masked out. If you want you can increase the soft edge a little bit to about 0.02 and then I go back into the edit page and it should look like this. Okay, that's it with this effect. So I hope this video has helped you. If so, then leave a like or sub to my channel. Go check the first link in the description for nice effects and transitions in DaVinci Resolve. Thanks for the support, stay creative and bye.